Hi, thank you for joining me today. I am going to go over how to use Genesis R&D to create a nutrition label that complies with Health Canada regulations. Two things. One, you have to have the Canada module to do this. And two, as often happens in these tutorials, this one assumes that you have your recipe or formula already created. So with that recipe on screen, click view label. Depending on what modules you own and what you have selected as the default label entry authority, you might first see a standard US label as shown here. Your next step is to go to edit label then, either by selecting from the ribbon or from the right click menu. When the label settings dialog opens for country authority, select Canada. It's never a bad idea to enter your household measures here, so I'm going to enter one cup for English and one toss for French. I also know that this recipe makes eight servings, so I'm going to enter that as well. And then click OK. Right there, we have the standard vertical full Canada label. From here, you have a lot of other formatting options, and I'm just going to show you a few of those right now. First, go back to Edit Label. This time, select Format Options and check Show Bilingual. You click OK, and then you'll see a Canada bilingual label with English and French. Just something to note real quick right here, if this label used French as the first language, the program would assume the punctuations should also change, and you would see commas instead of periods for the decimal places. Now, if you have a small package that can't quite accommodate the standard vertical label, you can use the standard narrow format. Again, go to Edit Label and select General. This time for Style, select Standard Narrow and click OK. This is the standard narrow label. Remember, we checked Show Bilingual earlier. I didn't uncheck it this time, but this is not a bilingual label. Why? Well, the regulations say that the narrow label must be in one language only, so Genesis will not let you use this label as a bilingual label and will just generate it as a single language label instead. Uh, let's look at one more format here, the simplified single serving prepackaged products label. This is for single serving items only, and there are some parameters that, that has to fit before you can use it, but I'm going to show you it right now real quickly. Um, I'm going to use a new recipe for this, my small carton of chocolate milk. So click edit label again, and for display type, this time select single serving prepackaged products. Now go to Format Options and make sure Show Bilingual is unchecked so I can show you something again. Click OK and then click View Label. Now you see that this time, despite the fact that we did not have it checked, this label is bilingual. Again, because the regulations require this label to be bilingual, Genesis R&D will generate this label as a bilingual label with both English and French. And that basically concludes the tutorial, although at this point you might want to familiarize yourself with other formats and how they work. Thank you.